Learning about rocks from space has taken on a whole new meaning here in Winchcombe. Ever since the town's very special extraterrestrial arrival. And here is the star of the show, a piece of the Winchcombe meteorite that was found on Rob and Catherine's driveway earlier this year. And it's old, 4.6 billion years old. And the fact that this landed near to where they live has really captured the students' imagination. I still can't quite believe it that this meteorite's in Winchcombe. It yeah, doesn't seem right. How unlikely it is just for an amazing scientific event just to happen so close to home, I think it's amazing. Mostly it lands in the sea and because it's obviously such a grand space, but the fact that it's in this town is amazing. It's so unbelievable that this is happening. I mean, wow, it's <laughs> from space. It's equally exciting for Rob and Catherine, who have parts of the meteorite land on their drive. They've spent the week touring schools with the team from the Natural History Museum. We've also done a, a meteorite forensic workshop, so each child's been able to examine the meteorite, and also that, that our experts will inspire the, ch uh, the children to become scientists. The story of the Winchcombe meteorite makes science real for the young people that live here and the small bits of rock that landed nearby are starting to reveal secrets already. We think that it was particularly full of ice when it formed and things that have a lot of ice in them are likely to be uh, represent the composition of what was around before the planets were around so it really kind of gives us that insight into uh, how our planet formed and, and, and evolved. There is so much more to learn, of course. The experts always knew that meteorites were this fascinating, but thanks to this special piece of space rock, now we all do too. Steve Nibbs, BBC Points West, Winchcombe.